Hey guys, welcome to the video. My name is Sean, spelled like Gene. It's been a minute, so if you forgot that, I get it. I totally get it. I am vlogging now, right here, next to my new car. Why did I get a new car? Well, that is a story. It is a, a couple weeks of just fun. Let's just say that. This has been a couple weeks full of incredible change. Al almost too much change to be able to fully keep track of it and know how to explain it and what this means, but I'm gonna do my best. And um, I'm going to blanket all the change right now, just kind of talk about it, talk about the overview, and then as you know, more things go along, we can get into it, we can get deeper. The first change, I mean the big change, about two weeks ago, we found out that Sam, my girlfriend, um, was diagnosed with type 1 diabetes and um, that is enough to just kind of totally shock you out of routine you think you're doing it and, and and all your normal eating patterns and timing things and um, it's enough to totally just knock you out of that and so that kind of started um, I kind of stopped vlogging for a little bit because I wanted to figure out how I can best support her in this time but that's not all that changed. I just told them. I told them what? What do you think? But we're gonna like go deeper into it. Yeah. She's like if there's tea, um, I'll the find the tea. She needs a dog. She needs I need a, a dog. She needs a service dog. She needs a service dog. A service dog. A Prince bulldog. Dog. Okay. No. I'm down for a dog. <laughs> like this isn't like an argument. Like I'm team dog. <laughs> let's, 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 get get dog. let's get the dog. I'm gonna get a French bulldog and name him Pierre. I want. So that happened on a Tuesday. Less than a week later, on a Monday night, um, I was driving my car, getting ready to do a video shoot for the women's ministry at the church that Sam and I go to. And my car, which was older um, and needed a lot of love, um, the brakes totally locked up. I skid on the freeway, crashed into the back of someone, and uh, totally ruined that car. So that car was done. One week ago, I found out Sam had diabetes, and then I totally wrecked my car. And that wasn't even the end of everything happening this week. Okay, you guys. This is John's. Are you gonna make a cool edit of this? Like, put cool music over this and like, cool. This is John's, what should I call it? John's video demonstration of chest to bar kipping pull-ups. You're gonna make it look for it. Say it with your chest, you know? That concludes John's video tutorial of how to do perfect kipping fake chest of our So after that car wreck, um, I'm already kind of, I'm feeling kind of down. I'm feeling kind of down on myself. It's embarrassing. No one likes getting in a wreck. The next day, my boss sits down with me and he kind of goes, you know, it doesn't really seem like you're excited. It doesn't really feel like you have that same like passion and oomph to be here that you used to have. You want to tell me what's going on? And I just had to tell him the truth. I was like, I don't think that desk work is for me. Like, I don't do well with that. And so he said, I'm not, I'm not firing you. This isn't it. If you decide that this is what you want to do and you just, you know, pull yourself up by your bootstraps and go for it, the job is yours. But I want you to be happy first and foremost. And I feel like you're not happy in this role. And that was just the truth. That was the reality. I wasn't happy in the role that I was doing sitting at a desk. So in one week, Sam got diabetes. I got in a car wreck and lost my car. And also I lost my job. And I'm that was enough to just like okay I gotta stop I gotta slow down I gotta figure something out <laughs>
brings me back to my car. After my car breaks down, after I get let go from the job, you know, mutual let, let go, um, I kind of started stressing out because I didn't have any clue what to do. Um, I didn't know how I was going to get around, how I was going to be freelance. Just out of a show of his character, my boss also was like, I don't understand how you're going to do freelance if you don't have a car. And so he went ahead on my last day of work and he got me this vehicle, um, which is just incredible, which is just great. So, I mean, if you guys don't have any RX Market products or anything like that, or if you haven't tried them out, just go to their website, go to their Instagram, and just leave a comment just saying something like, man, I think you guys are awesome, this company is great. Something just to show our support because he literally, he got me this car so I could do freelance, so I could leave his company and do my passion and what I want to do, which is more YouTube, which is more freelance. So, that was cool, man. Dave, if you're watching, thank you. The last few weeks, I have not enjoyed working out because I felt so sick and I didn't know why. And so today, it felt really good and I did really good. We'll do a whole video about it because I have way more to say, but, if you have any questions, comment below. <laughs>